What is up ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Fudge Muppet, my name is Scott and today we have a very exciting rumour brought to our attention by Adam Thompson, a longtime fan. Thanks, Adam. And this rumor is one about a Netflix Elder Scrolls TV series. This article I am referencing is from the site We Got This Covered, and I'll link it below. And basically it says, we know that Elder Scrolls 6 is in development at the moment, though nothing is known of what it will consist of, and all we've seen is a short teaser trailer that basically just confirms the title exists. It may be a while before we learn about it, but in the meantime, there's a new rumor being reported on by insider Daniel Richtman this week that says Netflix is working on a show based on the Elder Scrolls and that it will be as big as their take on The Witcher. This could be totally, completely false, so take this rumor with a big grain of salt, but man, would this be amazingly cool? An Elder Scrolls Netflix show given a big budget treatment could be sensational, and the Elder Scrolls has such an extensive history and large scope of lore, so it's a franchise perfectly equipped to tell many stories, and it would give the writers the freedom to create the stories that they want to tell with new characters and new problems. It's not like they'd be adapting a book series or a particular narrative. I mean, I hope to God they don't try to adapt the games to a TV series. That could just be awful, but they have the opportunity to pick all of these awesome periods in the Elder Scrolls history and tell unique stories that deepen and expand the world. Man, I really do hope this is true. The article goes on to say, one interesting wrinkle with this is that Bethesda Softworks is already developing a major TV series adaption of one of their games with Netflix's main competitor. Earlier this year, they announced that the Westworld team were working on Fallout, which will hit Amazon Prime sometime in the future. In any case, it'll be interesting to see when and where this is set. The Elder Scrolls world of Tamriel is a big place with a lot of history and hundreds of years pass in between titles. In addition, due to the games being about player freedom, there isn't a memorable character Character like Geralt from The Witcher to focus on. Still, I can easily see a show that explores cool elements like the Dark Brotherhood Assassination Bureau or the Thieves Guild, plus it'd be fun to get new takes on Daedric Princes, especially the ever-entertaining Sheogorath. So this news is not entirely implausible, considering that a Fallout TV series is in the works and gaming is becoming ever more popular, so these cross-medium franchises are becoming far more lucrative for these companies, and I can easily imagine an Elder Scrolls series taking off, considering considering the popularity of the franchise. However, once again, I'm not so sure it makes sense that they're in a deal with Amazon Prime and Netflix at the same time. But anyways, like the article was saying, there is so much freedom that the writers would have in this setting, so many cool things to draw upon, and I think a story involving the Daedric Princes would be really cool, focusing in on certain princes as characters in their own right. The lore is filled with stories of Daedra meddling in the affairs of mortals. It's a great setup for plot. It also makes me wonder how they would do it, like perhaps a Game of Thrones style story where you have a cast of characters set in all different locations that exposes the viewer to different parts of the world and have them all link up in the narrative, or perhaps a more focused tale on a small cast of characters adventuring throughout Tamriel. I also really hope they would explore some different time periods in the Elder Scrolls history. Most of the mainline Elder Scrolls games, Arena, Daggerfall, Morrowind, and Oblivion all take place in the later Third Era. Skyrim takes place 200 years later in the Fourth Era, and the Elder Scrolls Online takes place in the mid-second era, but there is so much more history and lore than just those periods. There is the early first era with the Elysian Rebellion against the Aelid Slavers with characters like Pelennor Whitestrake and Morahouse the Manbull. There are stories of the warrior wave of Red Guards arriving on the shores of Hammerfell, warring against hordes of ancient goblins. There are the wars against the tyrannical empire of religious Elysian Zealots. There is the rise of the Reman Empire and the controversial days of its decline. This is all just a handful of events from the first era, which encompasses 2,920 years of history, none of which has been explored by the games. And even if they did want to keep it more relevant, the War of the Red Diamond in the early third era is a setting ripe for a rich cast of characters and ever-present conflict. The story of how Potima became the infamous Wolf Queen of Solitude and how she fell into necromancy and dark magics, siblings warring with one another, political intrigue, a continent-spanning story that would allow us to see a variety of races, places, and characters on the big screen. I could talk about this 
for ages, but ultimately this is just a rumor. I've linked the article below, but remember, take it with a massive heaping of salt. But still, I can't even take my own advice. I'm getting excited at the prospect of an Elder Scrolls series, the perfect thing to tide us over till Elder Scrolls 6. What do you guys think about this rumor? What would your hopes and dreams be for an Elder Scrolls Netflix series? Any particular area of Elder Scrolls that you would love to see covered? Let me know in the comments below. In the meantime, you can check out our massive back catalog of Elder Scrolls lore videos on the channel and do subscribe to make sure you see all things Elder Scrolls. My name is Scott from Fudge Muppet and I'll be back to nerd out with you again next time.